Hey guys, welcome to the channel. My name is Erin. And today we're going to get into the official MV release of La Seraphim's debut, Fearless. So I'm really loving the kind of edgy fashion models concept that we've seen in their intros, casting call, and their Fearless show, um, which I did a reaction to those on my page. So if you want to check that out, go give it a like and... I'll be putting out a lot more Les Seraphim content as soon as they start putting out some other songs. So I'm really excited to see what this uh, first debut song has in store for us. They seem like a really talented group, so I'm sure we're going to get some amazing vocals and dancing. So let's go ahead and get into it. Three, two, one, let go. Um, okay. Mm. Ooh. I like her voice a lot. Ooh, the boxing gloves. <laughs> she said a new bitch. <laughs> Dude, I'm so here for the not just not giving a F what people think. Normalize that. Ooh, yes, they brought back the motorcycles. Ooh. With, like, ears. Hmm. Ooh. Mm. Get away. Oh. Their pronunciation is so cute. The black and white offsetting, like the outfits. Mmm. I like it. It's like simultaneously like old money vintage style with like really modern like streetwear style. And I really like that contrast a lot. Ooh. That is such a powerful line, though. Oh, my gosh. Like, normalize artists being treated like human beings with emotions. Mmm. You tell him, girl. Her voice. Oh, my gosh. I want to listen to that texture. Oh, my gosh. She has so much texture in her voice. Mm. Deep. This car is like two seconds away from falling though. <laughs> Ooh. What you looking at? What you looking at? What you, what you looking at? Uh, you because you're stunning. Get to get away. <laughs> I love it. Ooh, the diamonds. Um. <laughs> okay. Ugh. Oh, they're not giving an F attitude. I love it. Mm. Yunjin's such a good center. She has so much energy. Like, she's just... It's hard to look away from her. Ooh. They went so big with this. I love the scale of it. Ooh. Okay. That was the end? Why did I feel like that was so short? Like, I don't know why that felt so short. Do you think I'm fragile? Ooh, asking the real questions out here, though. Like, so many of these girl groups, like, I feel like they're really kept from showing that fearless side of them that, like, pushes boundaries and, like, breaks stereotypes. And I'm really here for that sort of mindset. Like, remember what Yunjin said in her intro? Was she was like, I want to change the industry. I'm just really excited to see 
how they grow and how they push those stereotypes because they really need more of that in this industry. Like, I think people need to become more open to certain, like, like this concept isn't reserved just for girl groups or just for boy groups. Like, everyone should be able to try out different concepts and really show their versatility. So I really like what they're doing. I think it's so important, this type of mentality of just, you know, allowing artists to really show who they are and not just putting them into a box. Like, I know a lot of artists are assigned, like, certain roles in the group and stuff like that. I can see a little bit of that in La Seraphim already, but I'm really hoping that they do it in a way that's, like, look at all these different types of people, you know? Like, I really hope they let them really show their true nature and their true character rather than just, here's the persona I've been assigned. Um, we'll see more from them, you know? I'm sure we'll figure out, like where high B and source music are going with this concept um if it's going to be different or if it's just going to be much of the same you know that kind of remains to be seen um i did like this song i think i think part of me was expecting something a little bit bigger to be honest with you like it felt a little bit um lacking in certain parts not not the vocals not the dancing like those were all phenomenal but like the music, I felt like I really wanted to hear a little bit more instrumentals, a little more texture in the back of it. Um, but I really loved the girls' energy. Like they just really kind of shined in this. Like it was really just about them, um, which was pretty cool. And I liked the symbolism a lot, like with the car hanging by a thread and then like cut to like only being able to see Cheon through like these diamonds like this uh waterfall of diamonds like it was really beautiful um but yeah i'm excited to see what else these girls are gonna have in store for us in the future um let me know what other la seraphim content i need to check out um i haven't really seen them put out anything else but i also haven't been looking for it so just let me know if there's anything you guys want me to see and react to um who's your favorite member so far we haven't seen a whole lot of them yet but Yunjin's really sticking out to me. Um, I also really liked what I saw of Sakura in this. I think she has a really good presence as well. Um, but yeah, once they start putting out more songs, I'm sure I'll get to know the girls a little bit better. And this was a pretty solid debut. I really liked the old money meets modern, like, rule breakers collision. <laughs> that was such a fun contrast. So yeah, that'll be it for this reaction, guys. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.